Hey everyone, this is Disc Junkie, and today I'm here to show you 3 Iron. And this is a special edition from Korea. It's a very old, out of print release. And, uh, well, I'm guessing you can't read the title if you don't speak Korean, obviously. But the movie is called 3 Iron, uh, and it is, I believe, the original title is pronounced as Binjip, if I'm saying that correctly. Um, anyway, uh, it's quite a nice uh, Korean movie, I really enjoyed it, kind of a drama, uh, unusual, alternate movie. And it's presented in a, in a really beautiful case. This sort of goes back to the golden days of the Korean uh, DV market, sort of when they were releasing so many special editions in so many you know, interesting designs and uh, remarkable packaging ideas. It's got kind of a matte finish. But it's still, it's kind of golden, so it's a little sparkly almost. Kind of, kind of gold sprayish uh, in a tone. As for the case itself, this is fairly unique, or at least it was back then. Uh, you got a very sturdy cardboard exterior, which is actually held in place with a magnet. And, well, it's actually two magnets, and you can kind of see that they are, you know, sort of embedded into the cardboard here. So there's one here, and there's one here. And then you obviously got corresponding magnets in the, you know, in the cardboard flap here. So once you close it, it's closed, doesn't come out, doesn't fold up. So I always really enjoyed that idea, and uh, that's one of the reasons why I really found this release to be uh, very unique, and I really wanted to pick it up, because back in those days when this came out, uh, this whole magnet thing wasn't, you know, it hadn't really been done uh, too much. Uh, but it was fairly popular in Korea uh, for a while there, so yeah, I was really happy to get this. And I actually bought this from my good friend Mistafo, uh, who had a second copy of it, and I've been sort of hunting it for a couple of years, so uh, yeah. Glad I could uh, <laughs> relieve him of that and give him some cash for it. Interior here, we got two discs. And I can't entirely recall if it's English friendly, I don't think it is. Uh, but it's still a two-disc set. The movie has English subtitles, but I don't think the extras do. Either way, a uh, really beautiful presentation. you got these really nice diggy trays. So, as you can tell, it is kind of like a diggy pack, but at the same time, you got like a really thick cardboard exterior, and it's, it's kind of an odd fold-out, you know? you got a big cardboard over here, then you got a diggy pack which is sort of, you know, slightly off. So it's a quite unusual actually. Just turn it over to show what it looks like from the other side when we fold it out like this. So there you go. Overall I think this artwork is it's just it's really good looking. Just a really interesting case and it can also be noted that when this was first released uh, there was a first pressing uh, which came with the exactly the same case however it also featured a sort of bonus picture frame which was just you know, it, w it was just packaged together, so just, uh, I think it just came on the side and they sort of boxed it together. However, I was never uh, lucky enough to have the picture frame. Still, I think it's a really great case, just a beautiful addition uh, for a really great movie. And I mean, just notice you got this, got, like, it's like slightly indented even uh, for the logo here. I'm guessing it's the logo, I don't know. But anyway, that's it for me today. I really hope you enjoyed this, and I'll see you all next time.